hardly ever know where the inspiration comes from. This is Dale Tuhuli appearing at the unveiling of the Tuhuli Sanctuary in Omaha two weeks ago. Known as the pioneer of glass art, these new allegations surround his paintings. And then I started painting with the container itself. This promotional video shows Chihuly at work on large canvases, many of them on display at the Museum of Glass in Tacoma. The lawsuit accuses him of taking sole credit for paintings he allegedly created with another man. Michael Moy says he was initially hired to do construction at Chihuly's boathouse in 1999 and became a trusted friend for 15 years. But according to the lawsuit, over time, Moy claims to have participated in a myriad of clandestine painting sessions and that Chihuly promised Moy future compensation. In particular, Moy claims he conceived a pumpkin series in the early 2000s and with Chihuly created faces for each painting, but Chihuly took full credit. Very nice piece. Beautiful reduction out here. In 1986, Evening Magazine profiled the famed artist who admitted openly to working with assistants to create his glasswork. But Moy claims no credit was shared with others on his paintings which sold for millions. For those who worked with him, Moy claims Chihuly had two requirements, secrecy and unwavering loyalty. The truth behind the creation of his paintings has been intentionally hidden. On the same day the lawsuit was filed, the Associated Press published an interview with Chihuly and his wife Leslie, disclosing his battle with depression. That may be because the lawsuit mentions Chihuly's so-called frenzied and manic behavior. In a statement, Leslie Chihuly said the allegations are completely and absolutely false. But Mr. Moy apparently thought we would agree to pay him just to prevent him from exposing information that he considers to be embarrassing and sensational. He was wrong. In his advancing years, Chihuly is facing a fight for millions of dollars in revenue and a battle over his reputation. In Seattle, Alyssa Hahn, King 5 News.